I've been building my SaaS product over the past three years and for the first year and a half of it, it was before ChatGPT and AI became really big. And I've also been building in the past year and a half or so where ChatGPT has completely changed how software engineering has been done. And in this video, I wanna give my predictions, my opinion of how exactly AI is gonna completely change the way that SaaS products are gonna be developed in the future. So unless you've been living under a rock, I think you have probably seen that AI has been absolutely disrupting software engineering. In fact, it's making it way, way easier. I was a doubter at first. I mean, don't get me wrong, GitHub Copilot was pretty good and all, but then now with things like the cursor IDE and Claude 3.5 Sonnet and just a week ago having OpenAI 01 models coming out and doing a lot more reasoning and being a lot better at coding, I've been completely blown away by how much better these AI models are at coding. And honestly, it kind of makes sense. I really do think out of all of like the knowledge work out there in the world, software engineering as we know it today is going to kind of be the first big knowledge worker field to be the most disrupted. And the reason why I think that is because all of the people developing these AI models are developers. The pain points that they're going to think about are the pain points that they themselves see as developers. So that's why, in my opinion, developers and software engineering in general is gonna see the most rapid progress in terms of anything AI related. And we've already been seeing this trend for the past decade where software has become so dirt cheap to build. These days, you can build an app that can scale to millions of users, technically speaking, in like one week or something if you know what you're doing. Whereas pre-AI, you could kind of argue sometimes the hardest part about building a SaaS product was the actual technical components of it. Especially if you're building a SaaS for the very first time, it's gonna take a really long time to build it out yourself and figure out how exactly you go out and develop web apps, mobile apps, whatever you're trying to build. But now with AI, building software is so dirt simple and so much easier that the actual building part is not gonna be the big blocker that people are gonna face anymore. The biggest challenge moving forward is going to be marketing and distribution. I've already said multiple times in videos in the past that marketing and distribution is the hardest part of building any SaaS product. It's not building the technical portion of it. And in my opinion, in the near future, as AI gets more powerful and software becomes even easier to write, there's probably gonna be a time where you can build out an entire application just by chatting with it and telling it to put together certain components here and there. But I don't think AI is gonna figure out marketing and nor do I think it ever really will. Or if they do, it'll be one of the last things that people will figure out. And I think that's why right now I'm really shifting away from my, I guess, identity, my role as a pure developer. And I'm trying to pick up a lot more skills like developing and design and marketing and like a little bit more like product savviness, product awareness, just getting better at building products and trying to figure out what exactly do users want to have built. And by becoming a lot more multidisciplinary in terms of my skill set, that will really differentiate me in terms of the products that I build. That means I can hire less people, work with less people to build out a certain tool. Or even if somehow in the future, I wanna get another job in the future at another corporation, it provides you with more skills than just a pure software developer. Because once again, I do think that the pure software engineer and software developer role as we know it today is going to completely change because AI can do a lot of some of the nitty gritty work, some of the easier software engineering work as we know it. So I do think that the role of software engineers is going to change a lot more. And in my opinion, it's gonna become a lot more multi disciplinary in the future. So my piece of advice for any software engineer, any technical founder out there that wants to go out and build your own SaaS product in the future, I'll say yes, coding is still very, very important. And still right now, most people will probably not be able to build out a complete production grade application like just by chatting with it purely. But I do think in the coming years, the AI models will eventually get good enough to actually do that. So if you want to go out and build your own SaaS products, I think you should probably learn a lot more about marketing, whether that be search engine optimization, social media marketing, like guerrilla marketing, Reddit marketing, Marketing, whatever that may be, try to pick some marketing niche and try to double down on that and try to become a lot better at that because I think that's gonna be the real differentiator in terms of building and developing products moving forward. So those are my thoughts on how AI will completely change the game of how SaaS products are gonna be made. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Do you agree with me? Do you disagree with me? Fight me in the comments, roast me, whatever you want. But anyways, thanks for watching today's video and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.